Hi everybody, uh, welcome back to another episode of Let's Open Some Packs. Yeah, so today I have these here, which are these, um, these are casino decks from actual casinos, and I got these for $1.25 a piece. They usually are a dollar, but due to inflation, they just raised the prices at all the dollar stores, like a quarter or something. So, uh, yeah, and they had tons, tons of different casinos. I chose five uh, that I liked. I really like these, Nugget. These are cool. These were probably my favorite. Four Queens was pretty cool looking. Red Rock was this pattern. I don't know if it's coming in on the camera. It is weird. It's like, it reminds me of this 80s floor. Yeah, so uh, Binion's and the Pleasure Pit, which is a hilariously kitschy uh, back design. Um, yeah, so I wanted to open them up, see if they're worth it. Uh, a couple of things to note before you uh, buy these. Um, these are from real casinos, so these are real. Um, they're all from uh, actually like real casinos, which comes with one caveat. So I, two caveats, and you will see right now. I'll open um, and I'll explain what I'm talking about. Let's start with the kitschiest one, the pleasure pit. Um, so yeah, so I looked these up. These are all real. Uh, this one I think is inside one of the uh, Planet Hollywoods. And it's like some, it's like, you know, it's like super, it's all about like bikinis and I don't know, it was weird. But yeah, so the thing that I realized, so I put, I got all of these decks and, uh, and there were so many other casinos, um, like I said, but I chose these, um, there was probably like another five and I put these in a box. I have a box of decks that I'm like, cause there's, I have so many playing cards that are everywhere and I'm trying to organize so I put these in a box. I'm like, you know what? I'm going to come back to this box because I'm going to review a lot of these and, you know, show them on, take pictures of them or something. And I put them in there, put the box away. Uh, and this was, this was like a couple, like I got these like a week and a half ago, like just recently. Um, went to the dollar store um, to get some, my wife was getting some, um, she was getting some, some stuff to decorate presents or something. And I put these in the box for like a day. And I opened the box and the whole box smelled like cigarettes. So just be aware that when you get these, and even now, like, um, I, I got these and I was just like, whoa, like you, you pick them up and you smell it. It'll, it'll hit you. Uh, it'll hit you pretty good. So just have that in mind when you, uh, when you, when you get this, get these decks. Oh, wow. Look at that. Okay. So they're aristocrats. Hey, I was just actually just playing with some aristocrats. Look at that. Uh, I got these at a magic convention, uh, from bicycle, um, uh, in, uh, in, where was that? Oh, it was in Ohio, I think. I think it was in Ohio. Yeah, it was at one of the magic, yeah, I ripped the, cell see, I like keeping the cellophane on. Uh, I taped it because I ripped it. Anyways, these are really good. Gold seal, bicycle. Uh, yeah, I'm breaking those in right now. They're really nice. Okay, so these have been played with real people. And then here's the second caveat. So the first one is they smell like cigarettes. The second one is the corners are clipped. So uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna review while well, I review these. Okay, so yeah, so right off the back, I can tell you that dribbling is gonna be a little weird because that corner usually I use this corner for uh, for dribbling. Uh, they feel great. Just the pips are large, so these are casino uh, casino cards. So I'm assuming the yeah all the aces are the four pips. You can see that there. Uh, standard usually has two. Uh, this is the four pip version, which is pretty interesting. Uh, yeah. Okay. They feel, they feel pretty good. They've been played with. Yeah, that's gonna be weird. That's gonna be weird. So what are these good for? I think uh, having them in the house, you know? Uh, yeah, that's, if they feel very, because that corner's cut, as I'm handling them, they feel smaller. Uh, like my, my hand's like, okay, what, are they falling? What, what, are they, what, are they, what are they doing? And my hand's trying to adjust, because uh, this corner one here is not there. So see, how, my pink is, you. Whenever I have the, the, the cards like messed up, you know, you, you kind of you kind of square them up. Uh, this corner is pretty important, uh, pinky and, uh, you know, and your index finger there. Or not index, your ring finger. Okay, so these, yeah, they feel really new, actually. They probably don't fairly yet. Yeah, okay, weird. But yeah, okay, so these, I would use these for poker. Right out the back. I'd have them out for poker. And so another thing you might be able to use these for... Um, is if you could tell, so let's see, we have, um, okay, so the, okay, that's cool. All right, and then 
Is there another one? There we go. So yeah, so there's the, the four aces are in there. So uh, the reason they clip the corners is because uh, the people, if people could buy these for real, you know, that you, you wouldn't want them to, you know, pull out an ace <laughs> when, they, when, they, when they're not supposed to uh, buy them in the gift shop and then go cheat at the table. Because uh, then it'd be like, hey, you busted, you know? Anyways, okay, so that's that. Pleasure, the pleasure pit. Oh, let me put them in so you can see the, that's the little window. This tuck is pretty, uh, pretty cheap cardboard too. You're not really buying these for the tuck. And they, they, this is a really good deal for this, for the casinos. Cause you know what they do is they, uh, they probably spend like two bucks a deck probably they, cause they buy a ton, maybe two bucks, maybe a buck 50. And then they sell them to the dollar store for 50 cents. So they're like, they're cutting their losses. And they're made by, by bicycle. You know what? Instead of cutting the seal, I'm going to take it off. Yeah, a little messy, but whatever. All right, so this is r the Red Rock one. And I've been by this one. Ooh, look at that. Oh, and these feel way different than the others. And they're dirty, too. You could see. Look at that. I don't know if that's coming in on the camera. Some of these are dirtier than the other. Oh, these quartz are cool. Okay, nice surprise. I love quartz like this. I love them when they're like, they're kind of standard. They're a little off. Um, the ace is cool. Oh, these are old, y'all. These are old. They're, 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 they're the smooth finish too. Um, so they're real, real smooth. Interesting. Okay. Uh, let's see if these, yeah, they, they, they don't feral too well, as you can tell. And they stink. Oh my goodness. I can taste it in my mouth. Blech. Let me drink something here. Oh, excuse me. But yeah. Yeah, these smell like cigarettes like crazy. Whew. But they're cool. I mean, again, I'd use these. Uh, I'd put these out. I love these aces. I might actually just take the aces out for reference. Um Man, that's cool. You know what? Why don't we compare all the uh, the aces here? Let's keep let's keep the aces out. Take that part of this, and I'm gonna take this seal off. It's sticky seal is bad. I think I, I don't know if you if y'all have noticed, but a lot of decks recently don't do the seal. It costs more. It costs like an extra thirty five cents a deck. Um, I'm gonna put that at the top. Yeah, there we go. Aristocrat. That's cool that they're different stocks. So so that's already a plus. So if you're going to buy these from the dollar store, um, just be aware that you're going to get a surprise unless you already know the casino or unless the casinos do the uh, do the um, the same all the time. I can already tell these are the glossy ones too. Yep. Okay, so let's just say, oh, these are these feel a little bit softer than the yeah. And they don't they feral very weird. Binions, look this up. Real casino. Cool back design, love it. And I have some real, um, some real, let's see what the cords, are these the same as the other? And maybe they get like a choice whenever they make these. Y'all might know more than I do. I never buy these because I know about the clip corners. My dad used to buy them a lot, play poker with them at the house. Um, I, I don't like clipped corners. Like I said, it just feels really strange. I can tell you right now, ooh, hey, new quartz. Oh, these feel these feel like plastic. So this is the Four Queens Grand Casino. Oh, and then these, okay, so these are cool. Wait, no. No, no, that's the same. I thought, I was going to say, these are cool. The clip, they're, they're, they're the same. So they're the same, because I can tell because of the pinky. Yeah, feels very strange. Oh, Club Angel. Okay, so yeah. They feel very, and I can smell the casino. Very, very, very cool. It's like I'm, it's like I'm in Las Vegas right now, and these are like matte. Very cool. Um, the, the quartz, the ace. So we have three different aces. This is kind of fun. All right, you know what? Let's let's lay them all out like this. See, so so far I would say are these just right now where we are in this review? 
uh, in this deck review of dollar twenty five cards. They're worth a buck. They're worth a buck. I'd buy one and just to you know what I would do it. Oh, 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 oh. oh that's cool. Sentinel Security Series. Okay, cool. Uh, what these are also smooth um, and they feel really. Look at that. So I would use these to practice certain things, like, and they're marked too. Look at that. They're like, you ain't using them, ma. Because mm -mm -mm. you want some guy, like I said, he's gonna pull out. I got four aces. Uh, uh, sir, you busted. All right, so um, check it out. The this the springiness of these is really good to practice things like, uh, like this, you know, because this this move here relies. A lot like if you have really soft cards it's a harder move to practice and the springier they are the the better uh, for that and you know and palming as well because they, they didn't clip I mean it might you might get used to the the, the fleshy part part here not having that but the, the two most important parts are your pinky and uh, this fleshy part right there so you know they're good for and when you palm a card a lot uh, the cards get messed up pretty quick they get all sweaty and soggy. So I would buy them just for that, for palming. And check the stock. You could feel them. Uh, they didn't have cellophane. So I would not practice palming with, with, these are really smooth. This is like a magazine cover, you know? Um, very interesting stock. Um, and I guess they're different manufacturers. We know, uh, you know, this is the USPCC. Um, I don't know these other ones, maybe y'all do. Uh, if y'all wanna leave in the comments who they are. I've never heard of them, never seen them before. But yeah, that's it. That's the review. That's it. It's a short one. Um, I know it's longer than short for me. <laughs> uh, but yeah, thanks for watching. And make sure you like and subscribe and um, all that good stuff. See you later.